Now in its fifth year running, the Screen Media Expo 2012 is shaping up to be the biggest and best ever. Let's go and talk to some of the people inside. I came here with Paolo, um, who has been working with uh, T-Connectivity and Elo Touch Systems. So can you tell us a little bit about some of the displays that you have here? Sure. So here at the Digital Signage um, Show, we're showcasing displays ranging from 32 inches to 55 inches. And uh, we, go, we have um, solutions that provide dual touch or multiple touch, up to four touches. And they can all be run with um, a computer or a Mac, Linux-based system. And we provide also an um, optional uh, computer module can be slotted into these devices. So the solutions you see here can be used for entertainment, it can be used for wayfinding, for point of information. And um, we're mainly a hardware manufacturer, but uh, what you can do with the device, then it's up to what kind of software you want to run. And I suppose, like, for example, that with the one that you have over here for the Hilton New York, it would actually free up some of the resources that you might otherwise allocate to staffing the hotel with personnel. That's correct. So the idea, for example, the application here, is that uh, customers want, they don't have to wait for a concierge or the reception to be available to answer some of the questions, but if they have an idle time, for example, near the bar or near the entrance, they can look up information themselves in terms of services that the hotel can provide, services nearby the hotel, the weather forecast, uh, the schedule of um, public transport or the flight information, if they've got to go to the airport and catch their flight back home, for example. And so do you help them format the information that they're going to find within the screens or is that up to the client to develop and simply provide to you? Okay, so we're mainly a hardware manufacturer, so uh, software and development software is not our core business. What we can do for the client is we can put them in touch with uh, another companies that we work with that do handle uh, and are very good at handling the software aspect. So for example here, there's software from this company called Four Winds and uh, Yesterday we had one of the representatives here on the booth with us, and so if anyone is interested, besides their hardware also on software running, then uh, we will put them in touch with Four Winds, and they would be in a better place to explain to them what can be done and what advantages their software would bring. And what are some of the advantages that you get from having like multi-touch on on a touch screen? As you know, like using up to four gestures instead of just one. Well, multi-touch has pretty much become the standard because now on your smartphone or your iPhone or your iPad, you're just used at some gestures, whether it's rotating and pinching and zoom or shrinking, that you, you can do only if you have two uh, simultaneous touch points or more. So um, still a lot of applications will work with single touch because they were designed for a mouse, but uh, more and more people are coming up with applications that use two or more fingers and it's just to make the application more intuitive. Cool. And what are some of the most interesting applications that you've seen using your touch screens in some of your clients' showcases? We have a very broad uh, customer base. I mean, we have customers that are using our screens for uh, gaming, so in casinos, really for actual gambling games. Um, we have uh, customers who use it for industrial control. Um, you can have it. Some customers use it, for example, to showcase uh, real estate and others to show like uh, art. Uh, and there's a, oh, excuse me, I'm going to turn this off. Sorry about that. There you go. Um, we have, um, so yeah, industrial customers also use it, for example, for uh, scales, scales use the supermarket. Um, and then, uh, yeah, digital signage, such as you see here, so wayfinding, uh, point of information, uh, customers use it for point of sales. Or and what are some of the innovations that you're hoping to see in the next year or so come about for digital signage? In, in terms of innovation from us as a touch manufacturer, what we're hoping to see is um, touch technologies that uh, will allow um, more cost-effective production of the products, and especially um, will be uh, would allow us to have um, even larger screens because at the moment we're scalable up to 55 inches and we hope to be go beyond that because um, yeah, depending on the need uh, you might need to have a larger screen for example for a, a table or entertainment where you want to have multiple people on the same screen so you need a larger screen handling more simultaneous touches or if you want to have two, four or eight people collaborating on the same touch device. Thank you so much for having a chat to us. Thank you, Paolo. Have a great exhibition.